Hello everyone, a quick tutorial on how to use your uh, mobile phone as a webcam. Uh, I know there are a lot of apps on the Android store that can help you do this, but uh, the most popular one is this one, Droid Cam Client. Uh, it's a very good app, but uh, the free version is only up to 480p, that's pretty low. So I recently discovered another one, it's called Irion Webcam. It goes up to 4K, if your phone goes up to 4K and uh, it's free it has a small logo on the top right but you can just remove the logo for i think like three dollars or something like that four dollars i think the free version you can use it for as there's no time uh, time limits so you can use it as long as you want so you can see here i have connected uh, when you install this app the urine webcam you get to choose how many virtual cameras you want to activate i chose four which is the max and i have connected two phones right now one which is 4K format. This is an Axon ZT Axon 7. And then I have one more here. It's a Galaxy S8. You just need to enable developer mode and USB debugging on your phone. I'll have the instructions below for some of the phones on how to do it. And that's it. After that, you just plug in the phone and you're ready to go. Uh, just a quick note. This app uh, works with USB as well as Wi-Fi. But uh, with uh, USB, there's no um, latency. It's pretty cool. It works very good. This one too, everything works. So you get a better resolution than the Droidcam. I used to use Droidcam client and if you pay this one, you get up to 720p, which uh, comes with another small software called HD mode where you can switch from 480 to 720. A little bit more advanced settings for this one. So I definitely recommend the Irian webcam. It also works on a Mac, that's a big plus. For you Mac users but it doesn't I haven't uh, seen any apps for the iPhone I'm gonna do another uh, video at some point if I if there's an app that I actually recommend I know a lot of people use uh, uh, epoch come epoch come which is wireless and wireless we all know it's it's not the same frames per second so I'll, I definitely prefer the USB one so you can see here again it works great and if you want to add an OBS you just click um, the sources Video capture device, create new video capture. You can name it uh, Irian, let's say Irian, Irian 1. Okay, this is another cam, don't worry about this one. And you just select the webcam 1, and that's it. And now you're here. It's 4K, my canvas is 1080p, so I have to rescale it. it if you want to add the second one again video capture Irian 2 mine is number four it randomly picks the number so can't really do much about that you can see right here if you want this camera is in different scenes you just add a second scene easiest way to duplicate this bam we got one here we got the second one here. So ping, ding, 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 ding. There you go. That's how you do it. It's pretty easy. Thank you for watching.